they cover their faces. I don't know, just actually, like, I want to be part of this beautiful thing, but I don't know how to pray. She feeds me, she's like, could you show me how to pray, please? I really, really want to pray. So I told her that every calm we do different things because we want to connect Hashem in different ways. When you sit down, you're more focused. When you stand up, you're more like looking around. Everything's to help your energy be able to connect more to Hashem. She says, I want to be like those girls. I want. She sees her walking out the stage like they always pray. I'm like, don't do that all day. Don't worry. She's like, I want to be like them. So I want to tell you what happened. This little girl, she literally could see her next door. Next time you see her, she had an eye infection, and her eye was really, really like both eyes were beat red. And I felt so bad for she's like, I don't want to go to the doctor. I'm scared. I went to the doctor. The doctor said it's a very bad infection and I must take my medicine. How many of us like to take medicine? Oh, leave me alone, right? Like, I don't want to take the medicine. So I was thinking, you know what, Ariana, it's really important. You're a little girl and your eye needs to get better. She's like, no, I don't want to take my medicine. So I, she said, what can I do? So I was thinking, what could she do? So I said, do you ever say Shema? She's like, Shema? What? <laughs> I'm like, Shema. Like, oh, what, what, remind me what that is because, like, I don't know. Like, show, show me my sitter where it is. I'm showing it to her. Oh, that's about when they cover their eyes. Yeah. Okay, let's do it. So I took her hand and I showed her. I said, when you cover your eyes, you say, there is no one in the world who is more special than Hashem. The only thing that matters is Hashem. And that's why I'm covering my eyes. And I told her, I said, I want you to believe when you pray, I want you to believe that Hashem could do it. Hashem could change anything for you. Hashem could be your healer. <coughs> so she tells me, you know what? Every night when I go to sleep at night, before I go to sleep, I sit on my bed and I thank Hashem for a few things. I'm like, seventh grade, came from public school, is telling me this. I'm like, Wow. She's like, I thank Hashem for my friends, and I thank Hashem for my mom, and I thank Hashem for my dad, and I thank Hashem for the delicious supper that I had, and for all the people that I love in my life. I'm like, wow. And then she said, and you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go home, and I'm going to see Shema. And I'm going to cover my eyes, and I'm going to say, only you can heal me, Hashem, and I believe, I believe that you can heal me. So I said to her, like, are you going to see those words? I believe. When you pray, you pray with belief that Hashem can do it. This happened just a few weeks ago. She came back to me. A week later, she's literally in the room, you can see her, she's out there now. She's too shy to come in, I'm like, I want to bring her in. And she said, I want you to know that my eye is better. A week later, I'm like, did you use any medicine? I'm like, no, I didn't want to. What did you do? I said Shema every single day and every single night. And I said in my heart, what did, what did she say? What are the two words? I believe. I don't hear you. I, I believe. believe. She said, I believe. I believe. She said, I believe that Hashem is going to make me feel better. And when you open your sitter today, and when you daven, those two words should be ringing in your head. I believe that when I daven, Hashem is listening to me. And He listens to all that I have to say. And if He doesn't give me what I want, He has a much better plan for me than I could ever imagine. Have a beautiful day. I'll on your finals. Believe you're going to do an amazing job.